N0 FXB Andreas UK. M0 FXB, we're going to see if we can add my hotspot to this ICOM 705. So the first thing we do is come out of DR mode by pressing the call button here. Hit the menu. Then we've got DV memory. Then repeat a list. Then we're going to choose where we want to either add a hotspot or edit. So what we're going to do, we're going to go to United Kingdom. Now we've got all these, you know, different hotspots in the in the C CIV memory already. So what I could do is hold anyone hold anyone down. Doesn't really matter which one. And instead of clicking Edit, we'll click Add. But we could edit an existing one, but then it's the same procedure. So we'll click add. Sometimes you'll get a thing saying that memory is full. Um, but um, not in this case. So look, the, the first one is DV repeater. That's correct for a hotspot or a repeater. I'm going to name this one. Um, I've got three Pi Star hotspots. So we're going to call this hot. Spot three. Enter and then the sub name you can choose what you like. I'm gonna put Pi Star Home. Oh I think that's enough. All right, Pi Star. Okay, enter. Call signs important. So M zero F X B and then it's space space and then a lot of the time you would put B but when you've got more than one hotspot you've got to use a different letter so I've used P in the past I've used H so I'm going to try K today I think that one will be all right click enter go down to the next it all automatically puts in the word G for gateway for you the group's already been named but you can rename groups but we're in the United Kingdom group use and i always select yes now the frequency will be the frequency of your hotspot so on this particular hotspot it's 431.550 enter um plus or minus shift doesn't really matter but you do need to have because it's a hotspot you need a zero um shift if it was a repeater a local repeater you'd put a shift in enter Position, Proxima, and then I should know the position, but I don't, so we're just going to put 56. But if you put the right position, then when you do a search, yeah, um, longitude and latitude, it will find your hotspot as the nearest hotspot. So hopefully if everything's right, we can hit Add Right. Yeah, so it's put it in there now, which is good. So now the next thing is to test. Um, so come back out. So here we are. Now we we'll go back into DR mode. Hit the from one at the bottom. Now if I had put in the, um, you know, the longitude latitude, we could have done a repeat of search by hitting and say near repeater, DV1, hit it, and then look, the GPS is invalid, so it's, it's probably not even got a lot. But anyway, look, it's found them here, look. And it would come in this list, but there's another way of doing it. Go back. What I do sometimes, if, if I've already used the hotspot, I go to TX history, DV, and look, it lists the ones you've already used, and then to you to transmit, you just hit one of them, and it puts it in the from section. Because we've never used it, we can't do that at the moment, so we're going to have to go back to um, repeat a list, find the UK, and then look for the where it is. We called it 
hotspot there it is m0 fxb now it's dv mega that's a different one so we're looking for hotspot 3 pi star hotspot 3 so select that and look it's put it in the section here um so my pi star is already connected to reflector 30 so if you're just transmitting you you keep the top half as use reflector but if you want to change reflectors hit use and then go ref reflector and you can click to link reflector link reflect you can choose ones you've transmitted to in the past Direct, you can choose one here with direct input, or you can type in the one you want, look. And you've even got DCS, XLX, which is very cool that you can do that. Reflector, thir we'll go 30 again, set, and look, it, we key the mic. We are already connected, but... So it, it, it hasn't made the connecting noise, but what we could do, make, let's unlink and then link. So we go hit link, reflector, unlink, and then we'll key the mic. Hopefully that's unlinked us. SWR's a bit high. Yeah, it seems like we might already be on it. So let's try linked. Reflector, link to reflector, set. Let's try link to reflector. Seems like we're linked. Um, should we put a call out? Reflector, use reflector. Mike Zero, Fox X-Ray Bravo, calling on reflector 30 for a contact. Anyway, it doesn't seem to be there, but you can see how we've added our hotspot now. Um, what we'll do is, see the big knob here? As you turn it, look, you can actually change the use reflector, link reflector, even a te echo test. As you can see, so use reflector is the one it's on most of the time. And if we hit the from section, look, we can actually scroll through all the different pre, um, pre memories. So if you've got them all together, your three hotspots next to each other, you can just flip between them almost like channels. So I hope this helps you enter your hotspot. It's also a handy way of, um, you know, connecting to the different, if you do a, Let's go back. Quite nifty TX history. Yeah, there's everyone. There's a TX history. And look, it's got me there using the open mod 3. And I do need to check to make sure that the letter K is okay. Um, but you can change that. You can edit. Hope this helps. M0FXB.